I think there's a lot of confidence um, and, and, and I think a belief that we, uh, you know, can achieve something special. Um, but um, I'm sure a lot of teams have come here in the past and, and felt the same. Uh, you know, the, the proof is still in going out and doing it and, it, and achieving that and, and playing well. Um, you know, the reality of the matter is the team we're playing tomorrow and the venue where we're playing is not a place where a lot of people come and wins. So, uh, you know, we'll have to play better than we've ever played. Um, we'll have to make basically no mistakes tomorrow and we'll have to make sure the, the ball bounces in, in our direction to be able to win tomorrow. So the, the challenge is huge um, and, you know, we're just looking forward to that. There's not much to lose. And, um, uh, you know, if we can just put up a good performance, hopefully we can, you know, we can just put the pride back in the, in the South African jersey and, and that's something that I'm proud of. I think we, we're getting the nation behind us again. I think we made them proud with a performance last week and, and like I said, if we, can, if we can uplift our nation and our people and give hope to our people, uh, you know, then I think we're doing, we're doing our job because our job is not just winning and playing for South Africa. Our job is, is so much more than just that and, uh, and that's a massive job in its own. Thanks everyone. Thanks. Yeah, I want to, to be honest, I must say it's, um, uh, this is a pretty big game uh, and, and, and definitely sits quite high up in, in games that I've played in. Um, you know, I've been pretty unlucky when it comes to World Cups uh, and uh, <clears throat> that's a challenge in itself playing in a World Cup but um, you know bar that and bar let's say you know maybe a British and Irish Lions series you know this is right up there um, and this will definitely rank you know in the top three if not the biggest game that, that I've played in um, so yeah one that I'm very excited about uh, you know I was reading about but not being able to fill Eden Park a lot of the times when there's test matches and, and this time around there's a couple of hundred tickets left um, and that shows that the pub public also see it as, as quite a quite a big game um, and, and, and like I said from from back home the message is coming through there's a real excitement about this game and and people just uh, not even not even worrying about the result but just about the magnitude of the game and two two sides who's, who's on the up and two sides who's, who's been playing pretty well uh, coming up against each other and hopefully producing a, a great game tomorrow. John, just back to Mark, are you surprised that he doesn't have a home for next year in terms of Super Yeah, definitely. Uh, you know, he's uh, he's a quality player and, and um, you know, if, you, if you've got a world-class player like that, uh, you know, you want to you want to have him in your team. So, so like I said, we can do with a couple of backline players at the Stormers, um, and Cape Town's not not a bad place. <laughs>